My name is Paul and I've been around animals my whole life. I grew up in a household full of them. A lot of them were rescues. My mother sort of couldn't say no to any animals and uh, the family went along with it. So we had horses, fish, rabbits, many cats, many dogs, you name it. We even had mice that we rescued from the, from the cats. So that was the beginning of a lifelong uh, uh, companionship with animals. In the past, I've had marine aquariums, I've had turtles, I've had dogs and cats, of course. I've had lots of different species of companion birds. Currently, I have five Amazon parrots. Three of them are sort of special needs. Two of them are quite elderly. One of them has a, a sort of a deformity. Uh, the other two are more or less normal for Amazons. Uh, I've been around large parrots and uh, all kinds, finches, canaries, you name it, I've been around them for uh, 30 years now. What I like most about being a pet sitter is my wife and I like to travel and a lot of times we're in places where you might not necessarily have internet and definitely no cell phone. And the hardest part for us of traveling is saying goodbye to the pets. And then there's those times when you're out of contact that, you know, you really, it, you want to be sure that your pets are being taken care of by someone who's not you, but is as close to you as you can get. And that's what made me interested in doing this. I've done volunteer work and dog walking at a local shelter animal house. Um, I've also uh, worked with uh, breeders breeding parrots for quite some time and even did a sort of tiny bit of consulting for Denver Zoo where they were having problems getting some of their citizens parrots to breed and we helped them out with that. So um, I'm also a very avid birder with my wife and that's part of the reason we travel. Oh, you can't replace the owner while they're away, but you can try really hard to replace the owner and treat them like your own. And that is what I do with when I go and visit a pet. I'm never in a hurry. I don't rush. I treat them the way that their owners would be treating them if they were there.